Greetings tankers, my name is Adam Snellgrove and welcome to Best Replays. But first, let's watch a message from our sponsor, Adam's Premium Blend Dark Coffee. If your mornings are impossible without a mug of coffee as dark as your humour, well look no further. Roasted with the same intensity as left players, it's more or less guaranteed to improve your matchmaking and always have the RNG in your favour. Coming to a wargaming store near you. I like a cup of coffee. We shall be beginning our showcase today with a platoon replay, specifically Fanti the Molding Rat, Hold My Beer and Watch This, and Cthulhu. In a Kampfpanzer 07, Barask and a Lerve respectively. What a weird platoon. Nevertheless, it's Himmelsdorf encounter, so we're in store for classic hill brawl, in which Fanti and Beer flank around the castle. before the enemy team decides to collapse on our heroes. Huh, judging by this mini-map, seems like the friendly team has completely forgotten about the hill while the enemies are literally swarming it cornering our trio in what seems like a helpless last stand. Whoa, easy there, cowboy. That's a miss. Ooh, what do we have here? An arty that has been spamming us the entire match? That felt good. So, let's replay that again for our viewing pleasure. And what's the biggest benefit of taking over Himmel's Hill? Being able to mop up these remaining enemy tanks with ease. GG. And that's it. All it took was less than five minutes for Fanti, Beer and Cthulhu to obliterate the entire enemy team. Individually, these numbers might not seem very impressive, but a combined total of 10,900 damage and 13 kills just shows what a dominant performance this was. Impressive platoon carry for which each of our heroes will get 2,000 gold and a best replay style. Well done! Up next, we've got a tank that surely won't stir any controversy in the comments. It's the Chieftain! This one in the hands of Gnikiv, with a top-tier game on Sand River. And when presented with an opportunity like this, I fully expect a competent player to lead the charge right from the let-go. As is very much the case here. securing the southern flank of the map without a single HP point lost. Unfortunately, none of the enemy tier 10 tanks came forth to face our hero, which probably spells disaster for the green tanks on the other side of the map, if fast experience is anything to go by. Oh, are you lacking some engine power by chance, GW Tiger? Although it's not looking too bad for the green team this far, behind on tanks and less than 2k HP down.
You ain't bouncing this HE shell, Scorpion. Unfortunately, the demise of the 60 TP results in the exact situation I was mentioning a minute ago. Gnikip stands alone against three enemy tier 10 tanks. Sure, in good repair, but facing three enemy guns alone is not a favorable position to be in. Oh, better take out this 277 before the enemy reinforcements arrive. and the repair kit is on cooldown. Oh no way, how did this happen? Gnikif seemed to have everything under control. Well, it all came down to one hasty use of a repair kit and one missed shot moments later. Such tiny misplays resulted in Gnikiv not managing to clutch the game despite their near-perfect performance thus far. Even 10,193 damage and 6 kills were not enough in the very end. Instead, the game being a loss for the green team. However, as we were more than impressed by the plays seen in this replay, we'll be rewarding Gnikiv with 2,500 gold and a best replay style. Congratulations! Finally, the replay you've all been waiting for. In the Object 7032, it's the very appropriately named You Should Stop Playing Arty. You know, I'm seriously considering doing an episode in which we rate your nicknames as we've seen some gems thus far. You let me know what you think of that idea down in the comments. But for now, we're sticking to our double barrel ironclad in what's probably the most used opening position on Berlin. Good enough to even fight tier 9 tanks, of which there are plenty in this replay. This one might be an issue, however. Yep, that would be 3 out of the 4 tier 9 tanks here to face our hero. That's not gonna cut it. Speaking about the fourth tier nine tank. That would be two down. Oh, that's a bold move. That didn't really work out, especially considering You Should Stop Playing Arty now finds themselves completely abandoned by their team. Oh, come on! You've got to be kidding me! That was a shot our hero really didn't want to take, dropping them down to just 255 HP. Oh, oh, it's over. What? Wow, that was incredible. I thought this game was over. Still, we've got an unspotted VK16801P and two GW Tigers to deal with. One heck of a mountain to climb for an Object 7032 on just 255 HP. The VK is AFK! But also, it makes a perfect spotter for You Should Stop Playing Artie's arch nemesis. 
Yep, an all-out assault won't work here. Oh, what are you doing here? Now, with a final GW Tiger P not willing to wear out the W key, there's one piece of cover our hero could use. Yep, one shaped like a VK. And now that the corner camping menace cannot spot us... Oh, I uh, spoke too soon. Oh, that was close. Gee, gee, what a game. Wow, you should stop playing RT, fought against the odds this entire game, destroying all five tier nine tanks in some fashion to claim a legendary win. Obtaining a Kalabanos medal while dealing 7,499 damage, scoring seven kills and 2,246 experience. A well-deserved victory to which we will add 3,000 gold and a best replay style and the title of best replay of the week. Well done, you should stop playing arty. Now that was something, eh, comment section? A tank going up against multiple higher tier enemies all game long and coming out on top. I really do enjoy watching these underdog replays. Really makes my day seeing a lower tier tank win against the odds. So in case you might have a replay just like this, make sure to submit it to us. Upload it directly to what replays and share it through our system there, or simply link it on our community discord. We'll make sure to review each and every single one, even those 150 XP matchmaker bad replays. Yes, our team of volunteers gets to see those too. On that note, I'll move over to my usual outro, which is... I'm Adam Snowgrove, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheerio!